Welcome back. I'm Lana Zak. We are following breaking news from Israel after Iran launched attacks in retaliation to a deadly attack on its consulate in Syria. While the action was not unexpected, it is notable that Iran has launched weapons from inside their ter territory headed towards Israel. Now, those weapons will take hours before they actually make it to Israeli airspace. And moments ago, we heard from IDF spokesman Rear Admiral Daniel Hagari. Here's some of what he had to say. Iran has launched a direct attack from Iranian soil towards the state of Israel. We are closely monitoring Iranian killer drones that are en route to Israel sent by Iran. This is a severe and dangerous escalation. Our defensive and offensive capabilities are at the highest level of readiness ahead of this large-scale attack from Iran. Together, with our partners, the Israel Defense Forces is operating at full force to defend the state of Israel and the people of Israel. This is a mission that we are determined and ready to fulfill. And the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps has released a statement saying, quote, in retaliation for the heinous actions committed by the Zionist regime, which included an assault on the consular section of the Iranian embassy in Damascus and the loss of Iran's military leaders and advisors, the aerospace force of the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps launched a punitive strike against the occupied territories.